So we are going to be using our epic NPC man characters in a D&D campaign. So this is Honeywood. And a flaming tear in the fabric of reality rents open a few yards away, spewing forth billowing smoke and... <laughs> what do we need to roll to not go through the portal? <laughs> All right, everybody, listen up! These guys were bad mouth in our man! So she managed to sort of uh, avoid it. Uh, uh, dodging. Okay. I am <laughs> Find for me the shield of Gargo. <laughs> A mummy adorned with a, a glistening bestial shield on his Guys, the I think that's the shield. Literally, I said out of the, the shield. shield. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna get sick. Are you kiss of deathing a, yeah. a, a corpse? Yeah. Right. As you grab the shield, a voice whispers into your mind. Okay. You should return me to the Nine Hells. So this is a an infernal box used to house something of great importance to a devil. Uh, the person I know who knows most about devils is a lady by the name of Silvira, and she lives in Candlekeep. I'm attracted to her. They are, thank you. I'm not interested. Oh. Uh, well, uh, let's, not, oh, let's just leave, leave it Persuasion. Uh, this is a puzzle box. I'm gonna roll a persuasion check. <laughs> El Terrell's gone. Oh, uh -oh. dear. We're Sorry about your loss. <laughs> Can we, we go, go home? <laughs> you guys are so insensitive. <laughs> Sorry about your loss. Can, Can we, we go, go home? home? Wanna, Sorry about, about your loss. loss. Can, Can we, we go, go home? home? Just before you suck, you get sucked away, uh, so you hear Sylvia say, "Try not to make any deals." And then, I'm ready. Are we? Um... What's going on? Welcome to hell. Not ideal. Oh, we're oh, in hell. Oh. <laughs> oh. oh, who thought hell would be bad? Its, le its body turns oh. a brilliant, glowing white, <gasps> and actually becomes. A Lula! Sorry about attacking you. It's a unicorn. I will give you whichever of my vehicles you wish. Let's do it. I tell uh, you what, that and your no. soul. <laughs> and what? Your soul. Deal. Very well. Let's do it. Great stuff. He grabs out a piece of paper for oh, his thing. Right. Sacrifice something of who you are. I'm gonna stick my bagpipes on the plinth. There we go. Wow. See you, bye. I'm gonna give my cloves of garlic. I'm going to sacrifice my sense of self-importance. I'm gonna give up my heritage. Oh my God. My what? name's Mad Maggie. I'm somewhat of a collector. Maybe I'll take the ride from you. Our deal is complete. Here's the chain. Here's El Torrell. Boy. Oh, 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 that's a big boy. You're a chunky boy. This feels like a finale kind of board. This kind so of does feel like a finale. Cree. And it's his turn. He is going to. What's uh -oh. he got? Watch out, bro. He, he doesn't uh -oh. like the. Uh, celestial horse up there, so he. But he's also got the people. If Lulu Mossy dies, I am gonna be broken. Do not kill A broken Lulu. human. Yeah. I won't sleep tonight. Right. He's gonna use. He's gonna use poison mind on her. <gasps> oh my god! If Lulu gets Lulu poison minded, stuff. don't you Rob. Even. Don't mess with Lulu. Oh, she rolled a natural one on her oh. wisdom save. No, Lulu. Lulu. Lulu no. Don't you even. <laughs> She takes, she takes 25 points of psychic damage and she is blinded. I drop to my knees and go, Lulu! Is that your turn? No. <laughs> That's my movement. Uh, then with his other action, his other attack rather, he is going to bring out a whip. And he is going to, no, that doesn't do as much damage. He's going to do a different thing. Oh, he's, no. go, he's going to reach out with his horrible, gnarled, fiendish hand and just grab you. Uh, so he gets he a... Yeah. That's going to be a 15 to hit. What's your cave bear's AC? 12. 12, that'll hit. So you take 35 points of damage. Oh, holy shit! Woo! Well, How much? 42. 42. So the cave bear takes... Wow, yeah, seven 35. hit points. Seven hit points left. All right. Oh. But is it, it, but, but if can I just go back to the cave bear dies, does she go back to the So, as a druid, if you take another, say, eight hit points, yes. your cave bear drops and you take one hit point yeah. from whatever you were on before you transform. So, really, oh, I've okay. got. So, the, the cave bear's hit points are basically a buffer. Uh huh. Yeah. All right. So, nice. she's she's good as a tank when she when she turns bear. So, he does poison mind, disruptive touch, and then it's Greg's turn. Did you say you were able to heal? Uh, I've got some healing, but I'm using this turn to throw... This is my turn. Oh, that's right. Yeah. This F is basically my turn. FYI, um, as a wild shaper, like as a druid, um, mm -hmm. you can choose to spend a spell slot to heal some of your hit points while you're wild shaped. It's up to you. Why not? So, Greg, your turn. You uh, just... So I, I give Bodger jump. With what? What? what uh, you know, okay, yeah, it's a... I put two sticks in the ground and a long rubber band <laughs> and just launch. All right. 
poof, poof. He gets it out of his inventory uh, real quick. Slingshot, and right, you, your held action was to hold, get up onto bit. the wall. Uh, <laughs> one, easily get up onto the Would top of the wall. Would it be good to be on the other side? Yeah, other side. I want you over there. <laughs> just in the air. No, the other side. Other side. <laughs> Which way? Baron pokes him with yeah. his yeah. I just use my staff. <laughs> All right. So, Stop uh, poking my butt! <laughs> so that was your action to do yeah, that. That's you my action. Cast, you can do a bonus, and you can do your movement if you want. Um. Do, 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 do. I'm gonna. Your bonus could be. Can he bonus heal or no? He can. Can no. I use? No. No. You can use those. You can. T you can command him with. A yeah, bonus I think I'm gonna one. use Iron Defender, but then I can't get past. Uh, you can kind of right. squeeze through there. Okay, I'm gonna squeeze through. I'm just gonna charge. All right. That's dead. As soon as he steps into here, he needs to make a dexterity saving throw or slip over in the grease. Oh, oh yeah, of course. Oh dear. Twelve against plus. your own DC. So, uh, so oh, his, his dexterity again, and he's got to get. 14 or more, what's his dexterity? Uh, plus one. one. So no, he gets a 13 and <laughs> slaps down. Is it, is it, yes. is it, are we all, everything disadvantage on checks? Oh yeah, we should be doing that as well. On checks, yeah. Oh, right. I, I mean, what? He slipped oh. over anyway, so. He slipped over. Yeah, well. So he slipped, uh, he's used five, 10, 15, so he's used uh, 10 feet of his movement. What's yeah. his movement? Um, 40. 40. So he's got 30 feet left, he can use 20 of it to get up if he wants. Yeah, let's do it. So he uses, ah, he's got 10 feet left. Oh, so he goes bloody one, two. Yeah. So yeah. He's, now, he's now squeezed in there. He's not in it's melee not with him yet. Range. Is there any of range stuff at all? I uh, don't think he has range. Yeah, no, I don't he can so. repair and he can do this arcane jolt if he hits something as well. Uh, Budger, let's take the rest right. of your turn. Right, the rest of my turn. Sun, mother, trickin, beam. All right, so from here, you reach down with the Daryl sword and you cast sunbeam. This is the hit, is it? Uh, yep, so you roll this damage. Let me uh, roll now I'm, I'm still Frenzied Rage. Uh, this doesn't matter for this. Oh, okay. Uh, it's a spell. No, it's actually a constitution oh, saving throw on his part. So it doesn't matter. Oh, it, it doesn't it's, matter me, yeah. it's me that has to roll. Um, so you you just think real hard <laughs> about killing this thing, and you feel a good... What do you, you think feel... about? I think about uh, California. <laughs> Here we just go. kind of the surf. Nice. Makes feel, I love that place. Uh, that's the sun. Well, roots. it's a sunbeam, so yeah, California. Like, you know. Nice, man. <laughs> I, I don't know why. Valley. It just came to me. But hey. As you think about California and the, just the wonderful beaches there and the warm beautiful sun. girls, and the warm sun, the hunky guys, that are, yeah. everything yeah. about yeah. The hunky girls. Girls. Yeah, well, whatever. girls, the hunky girls, the hunky girls, people. And, 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 and all the goodness of the world just just surges through you into the sword and you see it glowing. It, it's like a dim light normally. It gets to a bright light and then it's like hard to look at almost. And then it blasts out the end in a, a 60 foot line hitting this guy. He got a 17 on his constitution save. The DC is 18. Ooh. So he fails by one. Just. He fails by one, taking 6d8 damage. 68. Everyone, six, give him an A. 6D8. Oh, 6D8. No, 68. Oh. <laughs> you keep like, doing wow. that. He keeps doing that. <laughs> in, so in, theory, he could get, in theory, he could get close to that, though. Eight, eight time, six times eight. Uh, yeah, he yeah. could get 48. He could get 48 damage. Yeah. Very unlikely. <laughs> yeah. It's not going to do the math on it right now, but. 48. 48. 5, 8, 12, 14, 15, 7, there's 22. 22. 22, nice work. Nice work. 22 damage to Savius Creed. Nice! He is not looking well. He's still standing, um, but he's, he's, he's kind of... <coughs> he's, he's bleeding. There's huge wounds in his chest. He's not looking well. He's still standing, but that sunbeam blasted through him. And there's like a huge arc that's just caved out of his body, just like seared and... and uh, yeah. Yeah. He's not, looking, he's not looking well, but he's still, he's still fighting to the end. Um, that, was, that was your turn. Baradun. <laughs> Baradun, you're up. Baradun, what are you going to do, dog? Oh, there's a lot of people in the way. Um, I'm just going to do hold person. All right, on All right. that guy, you can't see him, unfortunately. Uh, you need to be able to see him for that. You could try and climb up here and see over this. Uh, if you okay, I climb onto the right. All right, make an athletics roof. check for me. This old Baradun wouldn't have climbed on a roof to save people. <laughs> no. You're going to run away. What? Uh, that was a, that's cocked. Yes. Uh, <laughs> and you still have inspiration. Between. Ten. You've got uh, I've got inspiration, I'll, I'll give it a crack, because my athletics is not very good. All right, where's the eraser? 18! Yeah. Yeah. 18 is much better. That's what you want, dog. Minus eraser. one, so oh, 17. you've got the eraser. Can I just grab that? That's what you want, dog. You've used your inspiration to... Uh, you, you feel scared. yourself getting Sue up... me. Huh? You feel yourself just slipping, it's harder to get a purchase on this thing, and then you're like, no, I, I feel inspired! It. I can do it! And you climb, climb, climb! Yes! 
<laughs> you're my, up on the my co-workers. You're up on the roof here, and from this angle, you can see Thavius Cree. And I think about it really hard, and I hold person. Yes, the hold person is to make a wisdom saving throw. Uh -oh. It's wisdom. Oh, natural one. No, no, no kidding. Uh, actual natural one. He misses it, which means as he goes to, <sighs> and he goes to hold his hand out and poison mind. <clears throat> You can see his eyes moving like, <laughs> oh god! Got it! Shut up! Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. I'm in concentration now. He has advantage against magical uh, attacks, being oh, that he's no. a super so devil. No! I wouldn't. No. Natural two. Oh. Still misses, still fails. Shame, 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 shame. He, he just can't hold it, he doesn't know what to do. Brielle, you're up. Finish him! <laughs> do it, Brielle. Finish him. Right, okay. <laughs> I'm gonna multi attack. So I can do two, yeah? Yes, you can. Bite and claw. Bite and claw. Yeah, why not? Okay. So roll a d20. Good see lead. if you hit. You get advantage because he's uh, paralyzed. Five. So roll again. Roll again. Get advantage. higher. 12. 12. That's, That's it. That plus your modifier of like seven, seven or something. Did, yep, seven. So seven. 19. Won't nice. hit. Nice. And then I've won't got. Won't hit. Won't? What? Nope. Why? He's got an AC of 20. Since when? You need to, the you whole need to get time. a 20 or more to hit him. <laughs> So no, even even paralyzed, you just you grab a hold and you just can't seem to he's, chow down. He's, he's literally bad. paralyzed. He's that good. I'm so he's, bad. he's the boss. He's the boss of the whole entire Ooh, campaign. So you know, I'm not gonna make him easy. Uh, level two. Um. Uh, so you, that was one attack though. That was your bite. All right. Claws still. Uh, good lightning bolt as well. I forgot. With advantage. Okay, 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 okay. With advantage. Again. It was uh, advantage. 11. 11. Still yes. not enough. No, not enough. MX. You bite him. You claw at him. You're, well, you're, I gotta do you're, something. You're actually else. making contact, but it's just not puncturing the skin. Okay. <laughs> wait. Do I have uh, another? That was my. That was your action. All right. You've got a movement and a bonus. That Shit. What's my bonus gonna be? Ooh. <laughs> Ooh dear. Oh dear. Can you just shut your mouth? <laughs> Like, no, 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 guys, can we you pause can't. for a sec? Just, 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 pause for a sec. I know this isn't helpful, but that was a little bit embarrassing. Oh my god! You're, you're on the top of, uh, <laughs> yeah, just, uh, guys, guys, can we pause for a sec. Everybody, stop. He's he's paralyzed. I know this isn't helpful, but can what? I just say how um, that was embarrassing? I right? just feel so attacked. I feel like all you've done is attack. Well, well, at least someone know, feels anyway. attacked. Am I right? <laughs> <laughs> Burn! All right. I thought you were supposed to be the good guy now. Sick burn. <laughs> I'm sorry. She set it up so well. Brielle, do you do you want to move anywhere? I want to go home. <laughs> All right. He, he, you run away. He would take an attack of opportunity on you as you leave his melee. Oh, no. But is he is paralyzed. Is the crew still there? He is still, still there, yes. I'm just going to slip. So make a, I'm gonna, you know what I'm gonna make do? a dexterity I'm gonna, saving throw. I'm going to shuffle the dance move back. Oh, yeah, nice. make, it, make a dexterity saving throw. And if I do it. I go viral. Wow. Natural one. Wow. So as you turn, as you turn around to, to run away, shit, poof, you slip over. You use half your movement Guys, to get up. This is real embarrassing. You move now. again, and now you can get to here. That's as far as you can get. Oh, oh grease real. all through your bed's fur. She I'm was so, so proud well. of myself. Okay, I'm <laughs> so proud of myself. Oh God, sod this. Oh God. Now that you ran right into the all right, like, but it's your line. turn. As you as you sort of pull back the sunbeam, you're like, damn, that was powerful. You can look I, at the sword, you realize. Cut. That the the tip of it is actually still glowing. It feels like you've oh, still right. got the resistance. Can I do another already. sunbeam? Or yep. You let's do you've, it. you've cast it once, but let's as long as you're concentrating on it, let's boom, do it. you can do it again. I mean, <laughs> do, let's do it. Oh my god. Let's do it! You aim at him. Uh, this time he makes the save, so he takes half damage instead. Oh, so, so he'll need to give six you. 6d8. D8. Everyone give over your D8 again. 68. Six. D8. <laughs> <laughs> one more. One more. <laughs> Not enough D8s oh, yeah. in there. Oh no, that's, six of them? That's six, yeah. Oh, Okay, okay, this is. okay, okay. Can you If you can do this for 20 minutes, we've got a whole episode out of it. <laughs> <laughs> What's it gonna be? Next time! Find out uh, after the break! Yeah, I don't know. Oh, there's an 8, there's a lot of one, good ones 3, there. 11, How's 18, 18 21, 27. Oh, 27, alright, yeah, yeah. Bodger! How do you want to do this? Wait a minute. Um, no one wait, that, you. that going mouse up, is going down. <laughs> Describe your killing blow. I'm thinking of, of all the positive things in my life that have led to this point, and I'm trying to um, funnel it through me. I'm trying to think of the people that have brought me to this place, thinking of my mom, thinking of my dad, thinking of like imagining what my life would be like, uh, like if I was, you know, an actor. But uh, okay, forget, forget about that. There's no hope just, there. Just all the. All the positive things, blacksmithing, <laughs> sausages, things, just everything that I love. And I, that was the second thing. That's the second most important thing in his life. 
<laughs> we all know that about Bolgeno. Smithing. <laughs> Blacksmith, vegetarian <laughs> sausages. You just get a bit Black of tofu, some garlic, you mix yeah. those together. <laughs> it's okay. amazing. I'm focusing this, plus California, plus waves, plus sunshine. Plus Scotland. Plus Scotland. Plus Scotland. <gasps> Ooh, what was that? <gasps> the goodness, the, selfless, the selflessness of your acts here today, the fact that you were willing to give this up, it seems to come back to you that... I feel myself again. Yeah. What on earth was that? <laughs> Baradun, you feel... These guys, what am I doing here? I'm better than all of them. <laughs> Why did I climb on the top of a roof? This is irresponsibly dangerous. You're, you're, you're walking away greased up with all your, your fur and you're like, man, I wish I could play the bagpipes. I know this one tune that... I know that you... I know how to play bagpipes. I remember. I proceed to play them or...? <laughs> no, you don't have them anymore. <laughs> but you, you, but I, you can... I, I turn to Baradun and Come I, I just take a moment to say, glad to have you back, Baradun. F*** you, Greg. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And, and Greg, you remember all the intricacies of how to farm garlic. Oh, oh uh, it's coming back to me, thank you. It's all coming back. You can... Right, I'm still, I'm still charging out a sword, yep. right? You're all taken <laughs> all away from time. my moment. This is my... F this is like the bloody spirit bomb. Uh, you can cook Dragon it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The trees, the grass, the rivers, and all things living in nature, <laughs> lend me your fighting spirit. And anything else? So you're probably going to do this thing so I get on with it. But, uh, as beggar, <laughs> I'm just going to... The thing blasts through him and it just incinerates and dis dissipates all of his upper torso. <laughs> And the rest of him falls take a moment. <laughs> Just oh. absolutely cooling the area with the grease. Even though you're a Black shithead, head. well done. That's punished. So. <laughs> Uh, with Thavius nice. being dead, nice. you need the companion return to normal in order to get out of here. An ear-splitting shriek screams out across the plain. Here we oh. go. Oh no. She's noticed us. You hear her saying in tele telepathically in your head Lenten as of Lulu revealing. turns around. Lenten of revealing. <laughs> Greg, it's not always useful. Just stop. Half, half a mile away, Bodger, you can see what Lulu's looking at this way. Half a mile away I'm and closing fast. I'm gonna look. A gigantic winged devil with head wreathed in flame shrieks oh. in fury again oh. as she jets towards oh. you. You maybe have 20 seconds to break the runes oh. that are glowing in front of you, holding the, the companion orb up, and also break the final chain, which you have not yet found. <laughs> okay, shit. Uh, 20 seconds. We've got 20 seconds. In game. In game. Each, game each round is about six seconds. To, to break the runes. You notice looking around that there are some runes that have been dispelled and exploded that seem to have been the ones to initially put the companion cube, uh, companion orb in the in the first place. And there are some that are glowing <laughs> that are seemingly right holding it in as is. <laughs> Look. Guys, I wonder if we should just fight this thing that's coming towards no. us. No! No, 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 that's, that's not a good idea, she says. Why not? Uh, she's much too powerful for you. Well, yeah. This conversation <laughs> station is taking a long time. Let's do it anyway. Uh, we're, we're, it's we're taking literally one second, trust me. <laughs> okay, one second. Lulu, Lulu sort of flies over here to kind of be the first one that she'll meet at least when she arrives. Thank you, Quickly, Lulu. dispel Jeez. the runes! Dispel the runes. Okay. Uh, do I have dispel? I've got dispel! Oh my god, he does! He jumps off the roof. <laughs> Unless you climb down slowly. I jump. You jump off the roof, make an uh, athletics check. Oh, I've got it. Uh, it doesn't matter, I'll just break a leg or something. <laughs> nice. Ooh. Uh, one. I one. break a leg. <laughs> he falls prone. Ow! I'm you, use your, you, you get uh, four points of damage. Okay. okay. Bam! And then you. Five, ten, fifteen. That's as far as you can go Shit. on this turn. Um, I'm gonna use what's everybody else doing? The spell mine magic is well. 120 feet. Yeah, but you need to be able to see the Damn runes. It. I'm gonna use mine as well. Yes, I'm gonna move. Right. You move? Yeah. Are oh. you staying as you or dropping your bear? Uh, I'm gonna be myself because I feel like I'm All more... Right. You push past here. 5, There's 10, no 15, 20, yeah. you get to here. You drop your bear to you. And then you cast Dispel runes, uh, dispel Magic on the runes. So nice. uh, this is much higher level than your you're casting at, so I need you to roll a uh, a spell check. Uh, 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 so you uh. use wisdom as your spell casting modifier. So roll this as your oh, uh, as your wisdom and three. That's what we're talking about. So that's seven <laughs> for you. Thank you. So that's it. Was a nineteen on yes. the dice. So twenty six. So with a twenty six, you see uh, all but one of the runes <laughs> flicker out. Mm. The uh, the orb, orb above you goes from a deep red through through like a, a dark pink. So almost white, it's just got the hint of red oh, left in it. 
and you can feel the entire um, city around you kind of pulling up. Every time it lurches upwards against the chain, you see the castle in front of you, the palace, pulled down as if it's the anchor. So there is something in the castle that is anchoring it to the to the ground. Is it the beard? So uh, that was your action. Uh, who's up next, Greg? You gonna do anything? Where are you? You're all um, over here. Yeah, I'm all the way over there. I'm so, I, I don't think I've moved this whole time. Uh, do you want to run inside? Inside here? No, inside here. This is what's holding the chain. Um, you need to I'd find and cut the chain after you dispel this thing, which is almost done. Lulu, Lulu. Uh, um, communicates to you guys, uh, and Bodger, you see this as well from up there, oh, yeah. that after every one of your turn, as a basically a god, she gets uh, a legendary action, so she gets to go after every one of your turns, oh, and no, she's no, no. teleporting 120 feet towards you, closing the distance after every single turn. Oh god. And on her turn, she can fly 300 feet, so what she is really closing like the distance. We've got like 17 so got more lots turns. lots of time to <laughs> no, no. make a choice. <laughs> Each turn is not a second. Each turn is six seconds. Oh. Um, you had at most three rounds to um, till she gets here. So cloud, maybe? quickly. This is this is one round. Go Don't inside. Give me a second. <laughs> oh, Krieg's dead. Greg, what are you doing? Uh, I uh, yeah, I'm gonna run. This guy, this person's freaking me out. You run. Yeah. All right. I'm out. So Greece, let me just check. Uh, last a minute. So we'll say it's it's over now. So you managed to run in here, and yeah. then dash in here. Yeah. I'm Boom. Just gonna keep running. This is your action. Do you have any spells left? Any spell slots? Uh, I've got a couple. None of them seem to be helping my. These ones you could cast. Um, where is it? They're all of these ones here. Oh no, sorry. Yeah, all of them. Expeditious retreat. That will let, let you run faster. Ah, oh, yeah, I'll do that. Cool. So you cast that. Sign it off. It gets yep. another sixty feet. Do as you see running, anything? As wrong? you run in here, you can see that every time the castle lurches downwards. The uh, throne itself is being pulled downwards. It seems oh, the throne. Oh, it's on the throne. The throne of hey. his palace is the uh, is the anchor. Can I? Do you have a bonus action to get your dude to run he, in after he's, you? He's used his action to uh, his action to dash, his oh. bonus to dash, okay. and his uh, movement. So you're all out. Okay, but I figured something out here, guys. Throne. Okay, I'm gonna use dispel magic on the last rune. All right, so you run, 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 run. You use dispel magic. So so roll your uh, spell modifier. So sorry, D. D20, yeah, as normal. And then add plus four, plus uh, add seven. 20! Natural 20! Seven bitches! Is that Lutches. the first natural 20 any of us have rolled? Might be. Uh, no, no, no. No, no he's rolled. He's, a couple of yeah, people have rolled it. damage. <laughs> you, you point your uh, staff at it? How do you do it? You just describe how you dispel this thing and turn the, the companion the, back to normal. The front of my staff, the <laughs> skull jaw drops open. Ooh, cool. Ooh. And the dispel magic shoots out of it. Oh, goodness. Whoa. And then right. sucks it into the staff. I want the magic. <laughs> so it comes into my staff. It sucks into oh, your staff. You might. I want that. I want uh, the magic. Real and Baradun, I need you to make a dexterity saving throw. Great. What have you done now, huh? I've got the magic in my straw. That is no longer glowing. Six. Six. Oh. Plus. Sixteen. Six plus what? Sixteen minus. Where are you? Did you say dexterity? Yep. Okay, just saving throw. Sixteen. Seven, eight, nine. Whoops. Nine total. Yep. All right. So as this thing explodes in the same manner as the other one did when dispelled, you each get blasted backwards, taking eighteen points of damage. Ooh, wait. As it blasts you over here, you're prone. And you're on the oh, ground. Oh shit. So, Don't worry, it doesn't matter, Greg. <laughs> yeah. uh, then it is Bodger, you get one more thing, what are you doing? Uh, I want to get over towards okay, Greg. Yeah. Alright, so you've still got the jump action, I believe. One minute, so you've got a couple more seconds of the jump, you can jump down onto the ground, oof, without taking any damage, and then you can use your movement to run in the one, two, so you can dash and get there. Alright. Hey, man. Hey, yo, hey. yo, yo, dog, what's yo, up? What's up? What's, then, what's happening out there again? I told and you. And then Zariel's turn. She gets even closer. Oh, oh. That's right. Fuck. At this point, <laughs> what's your Iron Defender's AC? Uh, his AC is 15. Uh, so from where she is, that's a so that's a 27 to hit. So that's going to hit then. Yeah. Um, he oh. takes 45 points of damage. He's dead. As an enormous javelin made of solid fire on What's going on? Shoot, comes, comes shooting out from this side, <laughs> piercing him, him to the ground and exploding him in metal. Oh. I am defender now! I wasn't that emotionally attached. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it was kind of annoying. Well, I, was I wasn't. I never really got to know him or her. Just a heap of metal. Kind of creeped me out a little bit. So yeah, didn't really care. But I tell you what, if Lulu ever dies, oh, that better not happen. Uh, he's he's gonna gonna fire fire away. Away. Technically belongs to me. 
All right, <laughs> you, you can have him now. Yeah, well. And yeah, then, no. and then Lulu casts protection from uh, good and evil, <laughs> and casts this sort of bluish uh, shield almost in, across the entire front of the palace. Right, Zario, please. Uh, I know you're still in there. We can, we can leave this place together. Come on, Zario. All right. You We're about to Zario now. Greg, Lulu. I know. <laughs> Greg, uh. your turn. We're about to okay, uh, she's, still she's, still she's probably here-ish. Oh, she's still flying, okay. Yeah, she's still on her way in, she just threw a javelin. Oh my god, that's so much pressure. Oh my Don't god. Something to do with the, figure out something. Yeah, so, okay. okay. Revealing. I'm yeah, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna detect magic or something. No, uh, <laughs> no, okay. I'm just gonna tell you really quick, I think something's up with the throne. <laughs> and then, <laughs> you Lantern can see of Revealing. <laughs> <laughs> which reveals ah. monsters and creatures, Ellen. Yeah, which re reveals Invisible things, remember? Invisible things. This thing is not, thing it's th very much visible. It's a throne that is done? the anchor of the thing. You need to destroy the throne. What have you Detect done? Detect magic. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. This, I'm you, not strong enough to do anything. Do you have a dragon that can just melt the throne, maybe? Yeah. All right. What we've got? We've got you, have you got anything that can destroy it? Um, or what anything that you got? can cast on him so he can destroy it? Um, can, yeah. Can you boost? Swords. Can you boost his attack for the next round? Um. Uh. He's. Um. <laughs> nope. He's really no, got none. I literally. What do your tools do? Your tinker You could. You could help. Apparently, right? they you can take a help action. You reveal that you're useless. Ah! Why you? I think I'm just gonna. Yeah, I'm gonna help. You hear the Bodger. help action. All right. So you run over to the the throne here. And I'll just point at it. And yeah. <laughs> Bodger. Listen. Listen. Oh you're like, I'm you're so scared like, to hold, the, like, hold the back of the throne so that it's got something to yeah. push against when he tries and does his thing. Roger, you that means when you attack, you get advantage. Thing. All right, uh, Baradun. Well, can, uh, so I can stand up. Yep, so that's half your movement. I'll just run up and stand inside. All right, 5, 10, 15, and then you're going to dash. Uh, can I see the throne from here? Uh, let's see, can you? Can you see past that? Yes, you can. Um, is Bodger in the way? Touch and go. Oh, okay, no, no, no. I'm gonna lightning bolt then. All right. Roll a d20 just first, just to see if. I'm sorry Bodger if I hurt you. You've got a lot of health though, so. Oh right. Eleven. He does. Plus. Thankfully, you managed to get it out of the out of the way Woo! of Bodger. Okay, now roll the attack. Uh, sorry, no. He, it it's, just it just takes the damage, doesn't it? Because it can't make a dex save. It's uh, eight d6 lightning. Eight d6. Here we go. There's eight seven six. of them. <laughs> eight. I need one more. I need one more. One more. One more. There we go. There must be the 10, Every DM's 15, 24. 24, very good. <laughs> it shucks it, make a dexterity saving throw. Oh, goodness gracious. And it's say you were holding the throne. Yeah. Oh, no. 12, uh, dexterity it was is... 24. Yeah, I got 15. 15? Yeah. What's your DC? It's magic DC, though, 15. 15, yes, yeah, so you only take half, you only take 12 points of the lightning damage. Self dash! <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> Brett! <laughs> Although you probably deserved it, you probably did something that. <laughs> All right. I didn't really. Then do Zariel anything. teleports. Uh, uh, teleports even closer. 120 feet. She's probably uh, about here now. Uh, Brielle. Uh, well, I'm gonna do some guidance. I'm uh, gonna run in and I'm gonna Brielle. give you some guidance because I feel like you need it. Uh, All right. Do, so you do, step up. Do, do, Five, ten, do, fifteen. Do, you can get to there. You get a dash that's, to that's get good to there. That's good enough to give guidance. Yeah. Do, do, guidance. Do, do, do. Uh, oh, is that a okay? That was my last level three spell. Oh no, I've got one more. <laughs> okay, so I give you some guidance. Uh, you video. Guidance. I'm just gonna give you this. What are you doing? Guidance. What? Right. Bonja. What are you doing? I I'm gonna whack this to the bottom of the throne and see if I can get rid of the chain that I think is right. attached to it. So you run over 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. You manage to get all your movement to get to the, the throne. And as you bring the sword back to whack the chain, the, okay. the sort of horrible putrid feeling of being diseased from kissing a corpse earlier. <laughs> it rolls up in your mouth and you vomit. <laughs> And you vomit out blood, <coughs> and your rest of your turn is wasted. I do remember that. I literally I gave you guidance for nothing. All right. <laughs> then, it is kissing corpses. then it is Zariel's it turn. Was his idea. Zariel uses the movement to get not. to Lulu. Oh my God! If you kill Lulu, Lulu. if you kill Lulu, she Don't. brings back her hand <laughs> filled with flame oh. <laughs> and just blasts it forwards. I need you two to make dexterity saving throws. Oh, oh my gee. god, don't. Yeah. I'm already quite hurt. Oh no. I'm, I'm already quite hurt. Eight. Ooh, 20. Oh, I rolled a 20. Oh, nice. Oh, I rolled a 20. Uh, a lemon. 
11 uh, plus uh, dexterity? 14. No, it was 8 no. plus 3. Oh. Eight, it was yeah. 8 plus dexterity. Oh. What is it? 11. And I got total? natural 20. Natural 20 plus your zero. dexterity of plus 0. Seven. Still not enough. Oh! The DC is 26. So you take all 23 points of fire damage as a fireball hurled through her. Oh no! Magic. I am nearly dead. That is Exploding to three de- guys, three health. Man. For the thumbnail. <laughs> uh, oh, and then no. with her other attack, she grabs a javelin yeah, out and she looks at Lulu. Don't kill it back, Lulu. Don't. And strikes. Rob, I'm not Don't. even joking with you right now. Don't. She's arch Don't. devil, man. She is the epi- no. epitome of evil. No. You're killing a unicorn. That's an eight. That's an 18 total because she only rolled a two. Lulu's on, armor class is only 12. So yeah, that hits, and she does 45 oh. fire damage. Oh. How much HP does Lulu have? Lulu Please only has 38 left. <laughs> so with that, she brings it back. <laughs> You should have left when you had the chance, Lou. Please don't do it. No! With an almost, almost quiver of regret in her voice. Ah! A fiery javelin strikes Lulu right down the middle, <laughs> pinning her to the roof. No! No, God, no. I'm going to make a clothing line out for you. <laughs> Greg. Anything no, you I, wipe, I wipe back my tears and I, I, I go, I'm going to, there's only one thing I can do. Disguise. <laughs> I'm gonna pretend like I know. I'm gonna be like, hey! I can't even see her in ages. Hey! How you been? Whoa! What have you been up to? So I'm gonna. What do you disguise yourself as? May may I make a suggestion? I'm gonna try it, yes. You have seen some of the ghostly angelic uh, Elter yeah, riders, I the Hell Riders. Yeah, I have been So I'm gonna dress, I'm gonna grab some cloth like and tie up. As old man. Man. Yeah. So hey, yeah. Old man. <laughs> so you disguise, your disguise self is just like an actual disguise kit. Yeah, you yeah. just quickly. <laughs> and I'm gonna walk to the front entrance if I can. Be like, oh, hey! <laughs> like real friendly. All right. <laughs> All goodly well, friendly. With expeditious retreat, you can get to here. Oh my God, <laughs> what's her name again? Uh, Zariel. Oh my God, Zariel? <laughs> Zariel from school. Oh my god! Zariel? <laughs> Wait! Zariel? Is that you? Old mate! Old mate, how are you? <laughs> hey! Oh my god! A deception check Fancy. with advantage. <laughs> yeah. Deception check with advantage. What are you, doing here? So what are you do doing, doing here? It's so weird. What a small hell. <laughs> Five. Five. With advantage. With advantage. With advantage. <laughs> and you've... And you still have your inspiration. And you've still got inspiration. Go again. Inspiration. Zariel! Okay, just go again. Okay. Oh, uh, 16. 16 plus your deception. Have you got deception at all? Oh, uh, should have at least a plus two. Uh, uh, plus two, yeah. Yeah, so it's okay. 18. Let's see what's her. <laughs> Z- <laughs> Surely not enough. Surely not enough. <laughs> what? <laughs> Let's make it an insight check on her part, see if you can tell. <laughs> Natural one! I'm not even joking, it was this one. Uh, amazing. Natural one. Oh. So she does have a plus eight to wisdom, but that's still not enough. Oh so my she, god! She oh strikes god. down true at her, and it seems like you caught her just at the right moment where yeah. the, the the sight of her companion <laughs> and long long time friend, Wait, what is, who what she just like? had does to kill. Like this? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> she just had to kill her long time friend, and it and, and it touched the goodness in yeah, her, yeah, yeah. the little bit that's left, <laughs> and she, and it brought back Zara? memories of who she was before she fell. Are you crying? She looks up. <laughs> And she's, she's, she just Marshall. drops her, her, her weapon for a second. All right, uh, Baradun, it's your turn. What are you doing? This is so weird. What are you doing? Uh, imagine seeing you here. It's so oh weird. Oh my god, small world. It's all bad. Oh. I. It's all bad. It's all bad. This guy's self. I, I, I need to do something to that. Uh, I'll distract yeah, Zario, yeah. guys. You, you guys um, I'm, out. I'm oh. sorry. I'm sorry, Budgie. You may be in the way, <laughs> but I need to. Ad- Is that really? You're gonna do it? I'm, you're in the <laughs> way, and I can't throw, move you out of the way. Uh, you do have advantage on dexterity saving throws okay. because you have danger sense as a barbarian. 14, 15. Advantage. If only I could protect you from well, that again, lightning bolt. Oh, oh yeah. Nope. So yeah, there's 15 total. That is enough that to take half net, damage. Net, 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 net. Okay, sweet. Roll, 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 roll all the damage. Eight 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 damage.
How do you want to destroy it? Yeah, you took 15. So the energy that I've absorbed in my skull for this oh, entire yeah. campaign, the mouth opens again. You let, it, you let it loose with a big lightning bolt. You, you sort of hear the crackle and as a barbarian, you kind of just have an uncanny sense of what's coming. You kind of dodge out of the way, taking only half of it as it streaks across your body. It explodes the, uh, the, the metal of the, the throne and the chain below it. And with that, the entire city is loose. And with a, a com glowing companion orb, she looks at you and says, Yael, it's been so long. And then, hey! the entire city sucked out of this plane of existence. Bye, Zarya! And slams down hard in the uh, in the area where it was. Oh. Back in the normal, Back in the normal material Whoa. plane. Oh. The city slams down into the crater that was about to become a new lake as the waters of the river Kianta flowed into it. That water is immediately and violently displaced, flooding oh. much of the city and extinguishing oh. the lingering flames and lava. Oh. It will take That's many years to rebuild, oh. but you have saved hundreds of lives. In repayment, the greatest minds of the Sword Coast develop a new teleportation to transport you back to Honeywood. I just want to put it out there, I saved the day. I destroyed the rune, destroyed the throne, well, saved the day. I feel like I destroyed the four of the runes. I just want to... <laughs> what? what? <laughs> I just want to say, what the... Okay, fine. This is who I am now. I don't know why, but it's come back. But, okay... This is a choice. This is a choice. I prefer this. No, I, I'm, I'm, I'm right. done with this. I want to go home now. R.I.P. Lulu. That's yeah. what I have to say about it. I'm that. starting up a clothing brand, Lulu Lemon. I'm adding <laughs> lemon to it. I just think it works. Sounds good. It's going to be fitness. In nice. her name. In nice. the unicorn's name? Yeah. Lulu Lemon. Okay. Fitness. Look just it up. Don't Google think about it. it. Don't think about it. I'm starting a chain. How do we get home? I, I just literally just read out that. Yeah, well, it's already happened. We're already home. No, I mean I want to go you, back. I want to go back to Honeywood and back to the yeah. Temple of Carnival. Would, would you like me to read it again? Yeah. I'll, I'll read it. You again. weren't obviously weren't listening. Oh my god, yeah. no, I don't. Oh my god, oh, it's so annoying. It will take many years to rebuild, but you have saved hundreds of lives. In repayment, the greatest minds of the Sword Coast develop a new teleportation to transport you back to Honeywood. It doesn't actually say. Congratulations, it doesn't actually guys. Say that they used it yet. Saved the world. Did we do it? We did. We saved the world. Go back in Honeywood. Yes. <coughs> R.I.P. Lulu. Wow. Everybody. R.I.P. Lulu. Can, can we have like a Memorial. montage at the end of this episode, which is like a, a Lulu montage? Like in, 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 in memory of, of Lulu. In, in memory of Lulu. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and, and all the all those best moments. Do you guys remember that time she did the glitter thing from her horn? I remember. Do you guys remember that time that as a as a unicorn yeah. she climbed up a chain? I, that was while so dope. Well, yeah. yeah. It was weird. It was that a was amazing. Side. I never thought a unicorn could like bend that way. Yeah, yeah. there yeah. it is. Mm -hmm. so Turns out they're more flexible than horses. But. So how was your journey to hell, guys? Did you enjoy well, hell? Oh. Fancy. It was more pleasant than I thought it would be. Yeah. You remember? You remember that time that he. Out outwardly pledged his soul to a demon. Oh after he's dead. yeah, oh, yeah. About that. Uh -huh, so uh -huh. you know, that's gonna happen. Eventually. Yeah. After Bodger's dead, he goes to hell. Uh, well, where his, uh -huh. where his, I don't like, believe in that shit. Though. You can put this in the credits, like the where they are years later. Greg yeah. went back to Gallic farming and blah blah blah. <laughs> Bodger eventually died of old age, where his soul was claimed by Bodger. a Rakshasa for all eternity. What? That was real? I thought there was just like <laughs> who believes in that stuff. <laughs> <laughs> really? This is literally what he's been hell. denying it while he's in hell. <laughs> who believes in this stuff? This is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> this is crazy. Oh no, that was awesome. Well, there we go. That That's our D&D &D. D &D campaign. D &D. Thanks very much for watching. Did you guys enjoy yourself? I much? did. Thank you for coming with us on this journey. Mm. I, I, discovered, I discovered a lot of things about myself. I discovered a lot of things about I myself I discovered well. a lot of things about Baradun as well. Mm. About, yeah, about Baradun and Bodger. Well, Baradun and Bodger. Yeah. You guys changed on this journey. I don't like changed. him as a good person. You well, like I, like I turned back to an asshole. Yeah, so yeah. Thank, nice. thank God. Yeah. Um, I was... You know what? I was worried from right from the get-go with that uh, the bandit battle that we got stuck in. <laughs> the the yeah. first one? Yeah. Oh man, it could have been a very quick campaign. It could have been. We could have died in that camp in that little battle there. Mm. Round of applause to Ribbity Rob. Thank you, Rob. Thank you. What a what a wonderful dungeon. Yeah, amazing job. Yes. Great job getting this whole campaign done in like <laughs> yeah ten minutes. And if that felt <laughs> rushed, because because it was that that's the kind of campaign that would take weeks. To but I can imagine long like, campaigns being longer. freaking awesome. I, I like, look forward to getting this descent into Avernus, the actual campaign yeah. when it was released, uh, yeah. and seeing how long it would take me to yeah. actually get from level one to level thirteen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Awesome. And being like, oh, this would take me two years of gameplay, <laughs> and I condensed it into four hours. Good, yeah. Easy, without well, a problem. <laughs> no <laughs> problems. And thank you, Brit, for coming along. And Yay! Yeah. Yay, me. Gabrielle. And Thanks then, very much. Thank you all very much for watching. Yeah. Fever! Bye!